Hi, this is Chris with Geeks on Tour, and I want to give you a quick look at the new Picasa 3 collage feature. It's so much better than it used to be. Step one is to select the pictures that you want in the collage. So notice I have five pictures down here in my picture tray. Click the collage button at the bottom. That's what applies to the picture tray. And here's your starting point. Notice I've chosen Picture Pile. You can have them all squared out in a mosaic or a grid of all the same size, etc. Play with, you can play with those choices. I'm choosing Picture Pile. I also want my captions to show up, and even though it's checked here, the only way I've found to show them is to choose this instant camera style of picture. That opens up a big white space, and the captions now appear. Now I want to move the pictures around. Just click on one to select it, and you can drag it wherever you want. Notice the circle. I can also spin it, or if I drag out to the right or in to the left, I can make it smaller or bigger or change the angle. So I'm going to do that with all of these. I'll pause for a second. You've probably noticed a problem in this, in that this middle picture is covering up these other ones. All I have to do is right-click on it and choose Move to Bottom. Another problem I see, this picture is supposed to be a very wide panorama, but in the instant camera format, it can't do that. So I need to take it off and make it be a nun. See how that made it? And I also, I don't need the caption on this one. I'm going to make that one none. Just one other of these options I want to show you, and that's the background options. I just love this. It's, this is called a color picker. And I, it's, the mouse turns into this little eyedropper, and you just pick up a color, either from the palette or from your picture itself. So if you, I want the background to be that yellow of the sunset. And when you're done, you close it. It starts out as a draft, and it now shows up in a special collection called Projects and a List of Collages. And there it is as a draft. But if I open it up again, double click, it says Create. That means take the images and actually make, turn them into one image. And this takes a minute, so I'll pause. Now you might think that now that it's one image that you can't change anything about it, but Picasa, as always, holds on to all your original work. All you have to do is click Edit Collage, and you're back to this, this screen where you can change things around however you want. And that's our first look at just one of the many new features in the new Picasa 3.